Before we start our tutorial how to make mass import, I want to notice you on one common mistake which we see very often. Don't import too much tags, categories and attributes. WooCommerce can work fast with big amount of products, but too much taxonomies make site very slow. There are several possible affiliate sites which you can do. In most cases, there are two basic difference. Deal site when each post item has separate one offer. And price comparison sites when each product has several offers from different merchants. For deal sites, we recommend importing your offers to posts. Such sites will be faster and more easy for setup. Let's start. First of all, download plugin RH Import Pro. You can find it in bonus section. You must register license first to get link on plugin. After downloading plugin, install it and activate. Now, go to settings of plugin and activate add-ins which you need. In our case, we will use post layout and post offer add-in. You can import by file or by link. In most cases, importing by link is better because it's better for auto updates. You can use XML or CSV format of files. Most of affiliate networks provide product feeds in these format, so you will not have problems. Usually, second step is made automatically, so, you can go to third step. On third step you must map each field of your product feed to fields of post. Just drag and drop them from right to left part. We enabled post layout add-in on previous steps, so, you have post layout section. This allows you to set special post layouts for deal sites. Theme has next deal layouts which are recommended for deal sites, compact with button block under title, big post offer in top. Compact with button block before title. Button in corner. You can assign them to imported posts or set them globally in theme options. If all of your posts are deal posts, we recommend to set them globally in theme options. In this case, don't install post layout add-in before import. And set post layout in theme options instead. Let's back to our field mapping. As we enabled post offer add-in early, we can see additional post offer section. It's very important to mention that posts have no real currency. So, you must add currency symbol directly to price field. In our case, product feed already has currency in price. So, we just drop this field to post price field. Now, continue to add other fields like categories, store names. Before you go to last step, save your template. You will need it later for updating posts. In last step, add unique identifier. For posts, you can use title as identifier. You can use RH Import Pro plugin not only for importing prices or coupons, but also for importing reviews with criterias and locations. You need to enable proper add-ins and settings for this. If you want to add location, you need also to enable Geo My WordPress plugin and its post add-in. Most of affiliate networks provide live link for product feeds, which has fresh data for prices and products. You can use this link when you make import. 
If you want to update your posts, you can simply find your import task and run it again. Also, in last step of importing, you can find schedule settings where you can set up cron or use paid service of all import plugin. RH Import Pro plugin is special customized version of all import plugin, so, you can use tutorial from documentation how to use cron. We will add this link in description. It's very common scenario when you want to use product feeds from different networks. You may want to prevent duplicates from such feeds. To do this, when you make field mapping on third step, add also additional custom field and place there any unique identifier from your feed. It can be encode or any other universal product code. Then, when you make new import, add it as existing items instead of new items. Do field map as early in first import. And in last step, choose to detect duplicates based on custom field which you added in previous import. It's important that your different feeds must have some common identifier, otherwise, use detecting based on title instead. Before you make importing for price comparison sites, make sure that you installed WooCommerce and Content Egg for your pro versions. Then, go to Settings of Content Egg and enable Offer Module. Don't forget to enable products and WooCommerce integration in general settings of Content Egg. Also enable Content Egg add-in in RH Import Pro. The next steps are pretty similar to what we did for posts. Map each field in content egg fields. From this place, there is one most important difference. You must set unique post ID and offer ID. Post ID is field which will be used to group all offers into one product. Your product feed must have such field for all offers which belong to one product. Offer ID is unique ID of offer which will be used to update price when you do updating imports. You can choose product layout for imported products. There are some special product layouts for price comparisons. They are content egg list and content egg auto sections.
However, we recommend to set them as default in theme option, shop setting instead of choosing layout inside import settings. In this case you can easily change layout globally in future. Next thing is very important if you want to have price comparison. Unique identifier must be the same as you set for unique post ID. If you set this wrong, plugin will create new product for each offer. You will see notice about duplicate products, but this is correct, plugin will detect that several offers belong to one product, and will merge them together. Another important setting is cash for offers. You can find it in general settings of plugin. Each product keeps offers in memory for special period of time. If you do importing an update in this period, offers will update price and availability. If you don't make importing in this period of time, offers will be deleted from memory, and all new imports will add new offers instead of updating existing. So, if you do updates not often, increase this value, otherwise, keep it as default. Now, it's time to update your products and merge with another product feed. Whole steps are very similar to what we did for posts. When you do another importing, choose to update existing items and add the same steps which you did for first import. Difference is only in last step. You must set special key name for matching. Set value the same as you set for unique post identifier on previous step. If you did everything properly, plugin will update prices of existed offers instead of adding new ones. If feed has another offer, it will be added to existing. Another important notice. Your feed must have direct product links without redirects. For example, this is correct product link because it goes to final shop page where user can buy product. Such link will generate correct logo image. If your link has deep link part, you must set link and deep link in separate fields. Check documentation of content egg for deep link settings. If you familiar with SPATH, you can also set SPATH for each domain in settings of offer module. You can find example of Universal SPATH in our documentation.